biggest change that I see happening in the next 20 years is that uh, there is going to be a big overlapping among the different industries. So there is going to be a fierce competition among uh, the mature uh, industries. So for example, telecoms will fight with energy companies, energy companies will fight with uh, automotive companies and so on. I think that the biggest challenge is to try to have a vision and, and foresee what's going to happen five years from now and get ready and be prepared. The reason why Enel Green Power is so successful in the, in the renewable sector is because uh, we had a vision five years ago and we worked to, uh, to make sure that uh, uh, things were happening following that vision. It's becoming a more and more sophisticated uh, world uh, that needs more and more sophisticated kind of professionalities. And uh, I think that that's going to be uh, one of the jobs of the future. Um, so obviously with all this big change, the big shift that you see internally is not so much business model, it's not so much uh, uh, regarding the kind of technology you're using, but the kind of professions that you need to be able to uh, compete and keep competing. Until three years ago, uh, cybersecurity was almost a bad word, I mean, or at least uh, a word nobody uh, really knew what it meant. Now I think there is much more uh, consciousness uh, within the company of uh, the danger that uh, you have in, uh, in moving into the digital world. Not all the uh, suppliers in this case, I think, are prepared for this big shift. Uh, which, again, is, is starting to create a situation where when uh, you are selecting your supplier, you're not just selecting your supplier based on, on the quality and cost, but also in the capacity that they have in uh, living and surviving in the digital world. The power sector is by definition very regulated, so it's much more important uh, to have uh, a, an open uh, and understandable regulation than have uh, a uh, an open uh, uh, trade market among the um, different countries. Our strategy is to uh, diversify risk and uh, to diversify risk we uh, diversify uh, in technologies that we use and we diversify in geographies where we are in. Um, and that helps us in edging uh, the overall risk of these companies that is investing you know, more than 2 billion euros every year in new plants.